What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Today I've got some 2019 Absolute Football. I did buy 2018 Absolute last year. I actually wasn't too impressed with it. Uh, I watched quite a few breaks and finally decided that I was going to get a box of 2019 Absolute. I bought it about a week ago, was trying to find a good time to rip it, and seeing how a couple of new products came out black, didn't really care too much for it. Um, especially because I didn't get any uh, when it was online and everybody's trying to resell it now um, and the price point's just a little bit too much that I'm uh, more than I want to spend for what you're getting out of it. I've seen a couple of really nasty pulls but overall uh, a lot of bust boxes and then obviously Spectra first off the line came out. Uh, my LCS said he should have it in pretty soon. I'm debating on whether or not I'm going to get a box or not. Um, I'll kind of probably watch a few breaks to see if I like what it looks like this year. If I do like what it looks like, I'll probably go ahead and buy a box, just one box though, because $300 is a little pricey. Um, so anyways, uh, Absolute, I'm sure you guys seen it before, three autographs and uh, three memorabilia cards or two memorabilia cards. Um, so let's go ahead and get into it. first week of football was uh, kind of disappointing you know the the Dolphins got absolutely robbed well not robbed they got they got their butts kicked pretty bad uh, by the Ravens a lot of the people in fantasy football that were projected to do really well actually did not do very well and then a lot of the rookies um, like Marquise Brown did really well Lamar Jackson did really well um, everybody's talking about how well Josh Jacobs did but someone that really impressed me um, which I expected as much was Devin Singletary. Yes, I know he didn't have a whole lot of yards, he didn't have any touchdowns, but the dude only played one half of football and he only had eight carries and he was averaging 12 yards a carry, which is really impressive uh, for a rookie. So they're going to definitely start giving him the ball a little bit more. So I'm really excited to see what happens uh, with him the rest of the season. And obviously, if you haven't heard what happened in uh, the latest and greatest with Antonio Brown, he was traded to the Patriots, and then I guess he has three charges against him for sexual assault and rape. So we'll see. It's a federal, um, uh, a federal um, being handled in the federal courts. So I guess we'll see what's going to be coming of that. So up front, we have Devonte Freeman. And then we have a Jerry Rice, nice, out of 189 out of 100, really nice. Mr. Saquon. That is absolutely sick, it is a canvas too. Tools of the trade, 14 out of 25. And that looks like that's the glove there, a piece of the helmet. And I want to say that's part of the cleat. That's actually pretty nice. Really, really nice. The canvas, 14 out of 25. Player worn materials. Super nice. I'm going to sleeve this up really quick. If you guys haven't watched my Brothers in Cards video, the one that I did with HH Twin Breaks, my only hit actually was a Saquon out of Certified. It's just a single color jersey piece, part of the number. Um, actually, um, you know what? This He deserves a stand. We're going to put him on a stand. In the background, it's uh, this is actually from last year's Absolute that I got from Thriceroni, and then that's one that I picked up from auction from Capital P. Uh, and then this next card is, ooh, the Tools of the Trade, back-to-back -back Tools of the Trade. This one is autoed, nice. So we have the jersey, the ball, and it looks like another jersey here, autographed. And that is eBay 1 of 1, 25 of 25, nice. Didn't get a rookie Tools of the Trade, but I will take Jared Goff any day of the week. And that looks like a little damage on the corner, but it's black, so what can you expect? Nice. Player worn. 
So two back-to-back -back tools of the trade, 14 out of 25 and then 25 out of 25, Jared Goff and Saquon Barkley. So let me sleeve him up really quick. And Tannehill, you bum you, you are going to get bumped. I'm going to put Mr. Goff up there. All right, let's see what else we got in this box. Richard Sherman, that is 21 out of 100. And then Kid Reporter. Nice, so actually the first box was not that bad. Not that bad at all. Saquon Barkley, Tools of the Trade, Glove, Helmet, Cleat. And then we have Jared Goff, Tools of the Trade, uh, Jersey, Ball, Jersey again. Roethlisberger. Uh, Steelers did not do that great. I actually had Connor on my fantasy team and it's a big letdown. It's week one. You know, a lot of the starters didn't get enough reps in, in preseason, which I can understand because they don't want to get hurt. But just shaking the du dust off. A lot of people are freaking out. And it's just the first week, guys. You let them play. Let them play. They'll warm up eventually. Ben Roethlisberger. Joe Mixon. War Room, Drew Locke. Is this an auto? Nope, it's just the jersey piece. So that is a... I got it upside down. 129 out of 199. So, not bad. Drew Locke, War Room, jersey piece. There's the auto. Darnell Savage, and that is 46 out of 75. Let me get a sleeve for him really quick. I saw him play um, in the Green Bay game. Uh, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I think, honestly, I think the best game was the Saints and the Texans. That was probably, without a doubt, the best game. I'm actually going to get a one touch, or not a one touch, a, uh, if I can find the right size. Um, probably the best game, hands down, was the Texans-Saints game. It was really close. I, uh, the Green Bay Bears game was really good. It was a real big defensive game, but still, I don't, I don't like seeing low scoring games. It's kind of a bore fest whenever it's <clears throat> just straight defense and there's not a whole lot of offense. And then Eli Manning, that is 69 out of 75. All right, so last box. Can we get some last box mojo going? Hopefully we, maybe we get a case hit kaboom. Maybe we'll get another sweet rookie. We still got one more auto coming. Uh, I think we got one more mem. I don't know if those. Well, no, I guess not, because the Saquon Barkley is not autographed. So we got both of our mems. So we just have one more auto coming our way. And this one is actually really, really thick. Yeah, look how thick that is. All right, so we got Case Keenum. I just realized it's off camera. Case Keenum. Ooh, that is nice. Aaron Donald. Short print. That is Gridiron Force. 17 out of 25. Really nice. Stanley Morgan Jr. 123 out of 199. Gary Jennings Jr. Sick. Oh my god, another one. Are you kidding me? That's three. That's got to be game used. Well, I guess it couldn't be game used because it's only week one, but practice helmet because that helmet right there is tore up. But it's the ball, the jersey, and the helmet. Rookie Premier Materials. Man, that's three in a box. This is an insane box. Gary Jennings Jr. 
and that is 68 out of 99. Man, I can't really complain about this box at all. I got two tools of the trade, Saquon, Jared Goff, and then I got a Gary Jennings Jr. I mean, might as well be the same thing, but it's the Rookie Premier materials. And even, like, look at that helmet right there. That is awesome. Well, Kenyon Drake, I'm going to take you down too. And then we have Jalen Hurd, short print, 42 out of 50. Another nice one. And then a Kid Reporter. So, not too bad. Um, we got Jalen Hurd out of 50. Aaron Donald out of 25. Gridiron Force. Eli Manning out of 75. Richard Sherman out of 100. And then Jerry Rice out of 100 NFL icons. Then we got this, probably like the most boring card in the box. Drew Locke, War Room. He is injured, so who knows how he's going to play this year if he'll even play at all but that's probably like the most boring card in this entire box not bad it is a rookie quarterback but you know we'll see and then we got the darnell savage um short print out of 75 uh sticker auto we got the tools of the trade canvas 14 out of 25 saquon barkley and that's the glove the helmet and part of the cleat and then we got the jared goff tools of the trade 25 of 25 Jersey ball jersey autograph and then we got the Gary Jennings Jr. rookie premier uh, materials ball helmet jersey which is pretty cool canvas again and that was uh, 68 and a 99 so this one's a little bit higher numbered but still not a bad card at all not a bad box um, so I do have a couple of other things coming in the mail like I said uh, my LCS said that he should have Spectra coming in Friday, which was kind of odd because first off the line just came out, so I don't know how he's going to get Spectra that early. Who knows? Uh, maybe he misspoke, but he did say he'll have it in Friday. Um, so if he does, I'll probably pick up a box. I have a buddy that actually picked up four boxes uh, first off the line. Uh, he's trying to sell them, flip them to make more money. I tell him that if for whatever reason he can't or if he just wants to be nice and sell me a box for what he got it for, um, I would gladly take one. So... We'll see what happens with that. Uh, obviously, I have Brothers and Cards subscription coming up, and then you, we have Illusions coming up, um, Prisms coming up. So a lot of good stuff coming up. So make sure you guys like this video if you like what you saw. Subscribe to my channel. Um, stick around for more and upcoming content. I will catch you guys later. Good night.